if you say that a little kid can make the informed decision to mutilate himself and to cut off his genitals, we're told certainly that little kid can make the informed decision to dance around for dollars. This is such a deeply unjust society. There's a video just put up by Angela Stanton King, who is a a right-wing activist. This was apparently the South Beach area LGBT club called Palace. The Blaze uh, reported on this video where it's at this drag bar and they bring little kids up on stage and have them pick up the dollar bills that are being thrown at them during this performance. Take a listen. Now I'm sitting here trying to figure out why in the hell these people got these little bitty ass kids at this drag show, y'all. But it's 1140 at night. It is 1140 at night. These people have children in a drag show in LA on the beach. Look at this. USA! USA! Oh, Telling her get her money. Look at this bullshit. Look at this bullshit now. Look, look, they giving them money, yo. Little girls now. Look at this. Look at this. And throwing money at these little girls. So we obviously blurred out the image. We don't want these little girls' faces to be out there. Uh, and we, we had to bleep out the woman's commentary. But I, I actually wish we didn't have to bleep out the woman's commentary <laughs> because although I, I prefer not to use coarse language in public, I prefer not to go blue, I think this woman <laughs> is saying exactly what we're all thinking. I think this woman, frankly, if anything, she was being restrained. Could you imagine if you, you, well, I guess you wouldn't be there, right? You wouldn't be at some drag bar in South Beach that would have kids dancing on the stage. But if you were and you saw that, what would you, what must you think? This is s- such a deeply unjust society that would permit this sort of thing. And yet, according to the logic of the left, that the left is pushing, especially on this gender issue, what's wrong with that? Now it's fun. It's nice. It's open. It's tolerant. It's liberating that these little, little itty bitty girls are being treated, or I don't know if they're girls or they're boys who dress like girls. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't pay close enough attention to the video and you shouldn't either. Let's just call them girls. What's wrong with them being treated like strippers and picking up the stripping is empowering. What's being, what's wrong with them having dollar bills thrown at them? Like they're, like they're just meat puppets, you know, like they're just flesh. We're just flesh. That's all we all are, right? What's wrong with them being sexualized? We're told that little children, three-year-old kids, ought to be able to make the decision to castrate themselves and to mutilate their bodies because they know their true sexual essence. They have a deep sexual nature. They are, they are sexualized from the very beginning, and they possess the ability to consent to these sorts of things, right? So we got to get rid of age of consent laws. We have to, if you, if you say that a little kid can make the informed decision to mutilate himself and to cut off his genitals, certainly that little kid can make the informed decision to dance around for dollars. That's a, that's a far less outrageous sexual sort of decision. Surely that little kid can consent to sexual behavior. If you're granting the premise that the kid can castrate himself. Where is the, there doesn't need to be a coherence. There doesn't need to be a logic here because what the left, the left is ultimately denying that in favor of willfulness and interest. If I want it, it is good. That is ultimately what this is coming down to. And justice never enters the equation. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? Where? Hold on. You don't need to leave so fast. First, please ring the bell. Ring the bell, subscribe. That way you will never miss a video that we put out. Something tells me that sometimes YouTube would prefer it if you would miss videos that we put out. So make sure you subscribe, like, really appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one.